The Switchbacks in their home blacks with the blue trim. And Sac Republic in their road whites will defend on the left-hand side of your screen. Who was the hero against Orange County last time out? As a substitute, he gets the start tonight. Jay Chapman lines one up. He's going to let it fly, and Vitiello palms it out for a corner on the far side. Good build up play to get that shot off. Decent shot on target. On the near post, it's Ciceroni who deals with the ball in. Chapman wins it right back. Skundrich out for McGee. And it's still McGee! He nearly pulls out his magic wand once again, but this one blazes past the post. Archimed and Felipe. That's the switchbacks on the attack. Malik Foster looks for the angle. And Romario Williams is patient, and he nearly scores. And Vitiello thwarts him with a good save down to his right. Set this up. And a dangerous ball to the near post. Musa gets his head to it. It's sent back in, and it's blazed over the top by Arnold Lopez. Good dangerous ball whipped in. Takes those to the top of the box, unsure at the start, to, at the start after his touch, but then takes a shot. Unlucky not to put it on target. Foster with some delicate control. Ball is curled in looking for Romario Williams! who couldn't redirect the header on target after a delicious ball played in by Drew Skundrich. Get themselves out of Leesburg with three points after all. And Pittsburgh are 2-0 up against New Mexico at the moment, which is good news for the likes of the switchbacks, as that's another rash challenge that comes in. And Arnold Lopez is going to see yellow here for Sac Republic. Those are dangerous tackles. Those are easy for the ref. Going in the back pocket and pull out the yellow. At the half, Detroit City against Hartford, a game that Trevor James's group needs to have. They lead 2-0 at the break, as do Ben Pierman's Charleston Battery against Tulsa. And here's Romario Ooh. Williams. Oh, it's absolutely <laughs> sensational. Wow. What a finish. A wonderful goal from Romario Williams out of the top drawer. And Colorado Springs takes a 1-0 lead with an absolutely sparkling finish. And not many of them have been better than this. Such a sweet strike there. Upper 90. Good luck to the keeper. Out of nowhere as well. Danny Vitiello was probably saying his prayers when he saw it struck. Nice reverse ball from Romario Williams. Skundrich gets it from Foster. And Skundrich has it palmed away. Beckford wow. was over the line. Did Vitiello wow. just bail out Sac Republic? It appears he has. Second look at this. Great shot. Takes a touch here. I think he did well there. I think that, that the switchbacks keep on coming. McGee leads the break this time. Foster in support. Beckford through the middle. It's Foster who drags it wide of Vitiello's goal. Russell Ciceroni has to deal with Drew Skundrich. Ciceroni looks for an opening. Does get his shot away. In the end, it's well held by Christian Herrera. Can open things up here. They have numbers. McGee leaves it for Beckford. Deshane Beckford keeps on going, and it's saved by Vitiello. Such a lethal counterattack here. He gets the ball wide. There's a hezzy and gets a shot off. Great save. And that's, I believe, how the half ends here at Widener Field. Oh, a very peculiar end. Nick Ross, the substitute. Here's Connor Donovan. He can certainly hit them. And he takes the strike on. He takes a deflection on the way through. The switchbacks get possession in the end. Speedy Williams onto this near side to Deshane Beckford. Has space and time to work with. As Romario Williams ahead, it's Deshane Beckford! Right down the middle in the end for Vitiello, but it was a lovely run. A couple of substitutions here, and that is going to be the end of the night. For Tyreek McGee, who gets a nice hand. Jairo Enriquez is going to replace him. With Oakland and Monterey Bay in pursuit. But here comes Sac Republic again. Pirano up ahead. Ciceroni 
Plays it back across. It's crossed back in via Dare's header. He is wide of the goal. And Herrera, I think, would have had it covered if it, if it was, I should say. Striding into the attack. Looking for help over to his right. Lacroix tries to stay on it. Does well to keep possession. Help arrives in the form of Deshane Beckford. Beckford goes for it. It's deflected and saved by Vitiello. Still alive for Speedy oh. Williams, who goes down. And Vitiello gets on the end of it. Brad Jensen says nothing wrong with the challenge. Here's the last sequence. It all starts with another lethal counterattack, and then there's commotion in the box. A few touches here. Risky tackle there. Aaron Wheeler trying to disrupt Shane Wheat. Fjellberg sneaks in behind to keep it in. Wheeler tries to help it along. It's Enriquez in the middle. It's oh. Jairo Enriquez! <laughs> oh! Wow. Absolutely incredible! It's an extraordinary finish from Jairo Enriquez! And the switchbacks are in dreamland in stoppage time. The roof comes off at Winder Field. Great pressure here. Keep the ball in, and there's a moment of magic here. Unbelievable finish. <laughs> what a dream finish that is. Don't forget that one. Both of the switchbacks' goals tonight oh. have been absolutely incredible. Vitiello gets a hand to it, but can't keep it out. Well, it's up to the referee's discretion how much time there is left. Pass is picked off. Oh, could be three! Oh, it's a great save by Vitiello to deny Enriquez a second. Wins another corner. And that's full time at Widener Field. What a performance from the switchbacks tonight.